welcome to an unboxing video of a new pen color with a really nice nib. And... <laughs> okay, hang on, let me think about this. What is the highlight here? No, no, just leave it. It's okay. Mm, okay. Um, hello, welcome to an unboxing video of a new Franklin Kristoff pen that I have. And... Uh, it's exciting because it's a new color. And if you're obsessed with Franklin Kristoff's, like a lot of us are, one of the really exciting things about it is the fact that there's a lot of colors to pick from and there's prototypes and there's all the excitement and we all get really excited because we have one of everything-itis and lots of problems that we solve by buying pens that are pretty. So that is why I'm excited to do this because I thought it was really pretty too. Now, the pen is in here. One of the things I really like about Franklin Kristoff is the it's just really minimal packaging. It's really low waste. I hate pen boxes. So I appreciate getting something that's useful and simple and tidy. So inside the box, you get a standard international short black and blue ink cartridge. You get a card that is signed by a team member that indicates your lifetime warranty. That means your pen has a lifetime warranty. Yes, that means if you do something terrible to it, you contact them. Uh, just the business card. And um, if you have a nib grind, you will also get a card that indicates what your nib type is, the nib size is, and who did the modification for you. So you should keep that so you never forget what your nib is, just so you know. And your pen, I had the pen out, but I'm gonna put it in. Did you see it? Stop looking. <laughs> Stop looking at my pile of mess here. The pen comes in a little leather sleeve. Super handy. I have used these countless times, not just for pens, but for other little tidbits that I stick in my purse. So that's all there is to it. There's, I, I love it. It's so simple and so tidy and it's very low waste. So this is the pen. This is the Franklin Kristoff Model 46 in the new autumn oak finish. So there is also the winter pine and there's the classic black, but the autumn oak just feels right for, well, it kind of looks like candy, like it's like flecked acrylic and it makes me hungry and it smells really good because I really like the smell of turned acrylic. So here we go. Now the 46 is, I've got a couple other models here just to help you out here. Okay, so this is the 45, which has a number five nib. This is the pocket 66, which has a number six nib. And here is the full size 66. So there you go. Just to give you an idea, it's a little bit taller than the pocket and the 45, but it's a full size pen. It's just not huge. Flat top, it's got the like tapered beveled edges. And the top has the Franklin Kristoff logo engraved on it. The cap says Franklin Kristoff. 46. It has the features that we like know and love, the block threads, so that you don't have like really sharp threads biting your finger. And also what it does is it um, prevents a whole lot of air getting into the cap, which helps it from drying out. And I have this one. I'm like, did I eyedropper this? We'll find out pretty soon. I think I put a converter in. Yes, I put a converter in. <laughs> that would have been fun. Um, so this takes a standard international converter, um, cartridges or you can eyedropper it which I love to do with all of my Franklin Kristoffs and I will show you as you can see I do that and I love it it's just amazing so we are going to look at this pen in a bit more detail and I will show it off to you and then I'll do some writing because it has one of my favorite nibs which is the Franklin Kristoff music nib amazing for all sorts of things, including calligraphy practice and flourishing and just generally wasting ink. So uh, the starting price for this is 150 US with just the standard steel nib, number six steel nib. Um, if you want it modified, like if you want your steel nib modified, you're looking at 175. If you want a gold nib, you're looking at 240 and up. But if you want this exact configuration, it's 160 with the music nib. So that's awesome. Like. I, I, you can't complain about that. So let's take a look at it in more detail and we'll do some writing and enjoy it. And then you can all run off and get one for yourself. Okay, see you in a second. 
Hello, welcome to the writing bit, the more exciting part of the Franklin Christoph Model 46 in Autumn Oak. You got a ruler here for scales. It's like about six, five and a half inches, five inches, just over five inches. Um, it is not a small pen. It's not huge either. Like the flat top kind of brings it down a bit, but it is a nice width. I find it very comfortable. And you've got those like the super smooth threads. There's no real big jump here. It just feels really good in hand. And if you're like me and you like to smell things, take a whiff of the cap. It's delicious like acrylic. Okay, so ahem, <laughs> let's do some writing. Um, This is the Franklin Christoph music nib. I'm just doing some wild block lettering here. Perhaps not the sexiest of handwriting, but you will survive, I am sure. Model 46. And in case you're worried, yes, you can still use this ridiculous nib for cursive. It's just that two words will fill your line. Autumn oak, super pretty. It's like a dark autumn, kind of freaky brown. I love it. It makes me hungry. And the ink is Franklin Christoph dark chocolate, super pretty. Now, as for line variation, because it is a music stub, untipped, you get really fairly broad downstrokes, like 1.9 millimeters and thin cross strokes. Pretty wet writer. Um, it's not a gusher the way it's set up right now, which you might prefer. And um, you've got some nice line variation. So like, even if you're not into calligraphy, it can be really fun for hand lettering. But if you are into calligraphy, uh, I'm like, oh shoot, now I have to write something pretty. Uh, what is this, like foundational? Yeah, 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 foundational. Um, it's superb for practice because it's just easier than a dip pen if you're on the go a lot and you're not into dip pens or you just like pens like I do. So there you go. Thank you to Franklin Christoph for sending this over for me to check out and share with you. I hope you like the autumn oak as much as I do. I think it's very pretty. You can find me on Facebook, Twitter, Patreon, and Instagram as Gourmet Pens. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. And if not, we'll see you for the next video anyways. Okay, bye.